the basic rhythm of quality improvement is dictated by the plan, do, study, act cycle. PDSA, we call it, and that doesn't stand for People's Dispensary for Sick Animals. It's plan, do, study, act. And what this rhythm of continuous improvement is, is small-scale experimentation to try and find out whether your idea will work. So we start with the plan. What's the idea? What's the improvement? What's the change to the process that might or might not work? You then do. So you implement the change and you collect the right information um, to see whether it's happened or not. And collecting data often puts people off, but it can be a before and after photograph. It could be a simple tally chart, you know, a five bar gate of counting things. It doesn't have to be sophisticated data, although sometimes it is. Um, uh, but really you're making sure as you do, you collect some information so that you can study the result of your small scale change. So you plan it, you do it, collecting the information as you go, and then you study it and say, did what we expected happen? Was it an improvement? Did it help the patient? Did it shorten the amount of time? Did it reduce the waste? Whatever that might be. And then you act on the study of the change. So in the case of perhaps changing a process step, you've done it in a small way with one team, the action might be, right, all teams are going to do this. Now we're going to have it as new kind of standard work for everybody. It changes our standard operating processes, etc. So each time you do an improvement, think small scale, think plan, do, study, act. And as you progress, the cycles of the plan, do, study, act build up to bigger changes.